Well, they are here, and they're making a lot of noise. Of course, we're talking about cicadas. Many of you here in central Pennsylvania have been seeing lots of them all over the region. And our Scott Mattis spoke with a wildlife expert today about the bugs, and he joins us live with the details. So, Scott, you know, we've been seeing these cicadas everywhere, but are they actually harmful? Oh, good evening, Maggie. The short answer is no, they don't bite. They're not harmful to humans. They're not harmful to our pets. Uh, we'll get to more of that in just a second. The only thing that's bad about them, besides the sheer volume of them in our area, is the noise they make over the next few weeks. That's going to become incredibly frustrating to deal with. Now take a look behind me. This is where you're going to find them. These are the woods, and we've got a lot of woods right now. And the reason why I say that right now is because they're kind of sort of sleeping, and they do that during this kind of weather. Now I spoke with Heidi Mullendor. Now she's an environmental educator with Canoe Creek State Park right here in the Holidaysburg, Frankstown Township area. And she tells me, just like any bug, we're going to see them everywhere. And when I say everywhere, there's a lot of them. Get this, Maggie. Uh, there's about a million and a half cicadas out and about per acre right now. But again, don't worry. They are not dangerous. These bugs don't bite. They're going to mate, lay eggs, and die. All right, so you heard it here first. Now, cicadas, Maggie, if you didn't know, they are non toxic. What that means, which is very important for not only us, but our pets, if our pets eat them, we're not going to really have a problem. The only problem we'll get into, I'll talk about coming up tonight at 6 o'clock on WTAJ News, and that is if your dog or cat eats too many of them. It's a little tease for you. Back to you in the studio.